What's going on everyone? Boss here again. This time we're here for a series premiere of Mashal. Uh, we're going to start with episode one, of course, and uh, I'm, just, I'm ready to check this out because uh, I've heard about this series when it was in manga form, and uh, I thought about checking it out, but never got around to it. But now that the anime is out, I have a chance to jump into the story, uh, which uh, it seems like this is like a mix of, or taking like elements and stuff from like Harry Potter, One Punch Man, Mob, something like that. Uh, so I'm curious how this is all going to go. So I'm expecting like action and comedy. Uh, hopefully it's, it's pretty good. Um, I kind of have high hopes that, it, you know, I'll enjoy it. So we'll see. But uh, yeah, I'm ready to jump into it and find out what's going on. <laughs> so without further ado, let's jump into episode one. Magic realm. Okay. Are there other realms that we can go to? Or this is just where we're going to stay? Oh, everybody can do it. So that must mean the main character can't, right? Magic determines the social status. Okay, magic is really important. <laughs> Dang. Does have dragons? Oh, yeah? Just... <laughs> just a super bench press. Post-workout meal. <laughs> Cream puff after pumping iron. Hey. I never heard it, but I ain't going to knock it. <laughs> Burn dead. Okay. Chic, elegant, 75-year-old. So, matches his son? I wonder what's going on with the lines on their face. Dang. You just broke the door. You just couldn't open the door. So is he like his actual, actual rel relative? Dang, <laughs> that's not how you put it back. Yo, he's gonna break more stuff. Yeah, of course he did. Oh, he can't use. Okay, so he can't use magic. That's why he just hit the gym, bro. Gym over magic. Oh, is he going to venture out into the city for some reason? Yo, he just went to go get food. <laughs> this OST is interesting. Dang, what you do with the money, dog? They still gonna take the money? Oh, okay. Just bending coins back and forth. Yo, he freaked out the, the salesman. Oh, so they're supposed to have the thing on their face. Is this a sign you have magic or something? Dang. Who's that? Oh yeah? We gonna magic him? Imagine somebody walk up to you imposingly with a with a wand. <laughs> oh no, it's known. He's just walking around. Was it worth it? Oh dang. You working? 90%. You working? Somehow feel sorry for you. Ooh. That was fighting. Fighting action, bro. Yo, he just ripped his clothes off. No. <laughs> He's not know how to function in, in society. Apparently not. Brad Coleman. I was not expecting that name. <laughs> Just nom nom nom. Oh, the old man. Oh, what you about to do? You gonna see your powers? Oh, you got a little magic. 
Magic Bird. Okay. Can't stay mad at him. I'm getting some creep puffs. Oh, he just taped up the door. Don't break it. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, the bird sees all. Is this going to be a thing where the parental figure of the main character dies in the first episode to motivate them or something like that? And why does the, the police seem so menacing? Oh, yeah? How's that training? <laughs> he just leaves the waist there. Is he going to remember how to open the door properly? Oh, he's struggling. Dang, so they get rid of people that don't have magic? Oh, dang. Is match about to just show up? Oh, this is his flashback. Dang, everybody's just terrible to him. Oh, wow. Dang, he almost ended it. Oh, that's when he found Mash, and he's like, hey. Took care of him. And someone just left him outside? Just, like, not even, in like, in somebody's doorstep. Just outside, in the middle of the sidewalk. Oh, then felt needed and watched over him. Okay. Okay, so that explains why he's 75 and matches his son. He just, like, adopted him or took him in. He's right at the door still. Oh, he's going to keep saying it. <laughs> he probably not running, though. Dang, buddy, let out a super blast. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, epic. Smoking fist, too. Enough. Yo, stop stripping him. <laughs> Ooh. OP slap. Dang, send the help? All right. Do you not see him just destroy those other guys? I'm surprised that guy's talking after he got slapped up like that. Oh, yeah, you hyping him up to only be brought down? I feel like he's just going to stand there and take it. Oh, he just slapped it down? <laughs> Dang. Oh, yeah, you going to try again? Oh yeah, all right. Another another slap. <laughs> he's still he's still trying. Give up. Why wow, he's playing volleyball? Dang. He turned you into a joke. Oh, he's nice. He should be in blue lock. He's about to do something stupid. He's not about to do match. He's about to like throw it at him or something. <laughs> yeah. Baseball pitch. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> the OST. <laughs> he just threw it. Man, it broke his spirit. He just confused. <laughs> Yeah, you didn't know you was raising a monster? Oh, yeah? Tell him to go to school. Yeah, I mean, this situation is not good. But either way, what if you do what he does and he still, like, reports you or something? 
So I, of course he's gonna accept. He's gonna go to the school because I mean I've seen the trailer, and the opening. He's going to magic school with no magic. <laughs> My son. Why is the school in this? Cause you know, <laughs> in this like crazy location. He's just gonna crush all the magic with his fist. Okay, I can see it's gonna be pretty funny because he's probably gonna be, he's probably gonna be nice and just winning, <laughs> just with his physical prowess. I like the ending. It's it's a nice nice jingle, with the dance moves. Can't wait to meet these um other characters. Shoe cream. <laughs> All right, so that was episode one of Mashal, and um, <laughs> it looks like it's gonna be pretty funny. Um, I'm just ex just seeing a lot of instances where Mash is just, he's just gonna be better. <laughs> just gonna be better than people, uh, and they're gonna be doing all these crazy magic spells, and I can see him just, you know, making a fool out of them. <laughs> so, uh, I'm glad it's uh, it seems it's gonna be pretty funny. So, that's good. Um, this whole situation of going to the academy to be like God chosen. Uh, I wonder, like, what that all entails, uh, like, specifically. Like, was that, you, I guess your status just increased and maybe they just treat you better, I guess. I don't know. Or, I don't know. But we see that there was one student that was selected. Um, he looks like another character, one like another one of the main characters. So he might be his brother or something. I don't know. He just has the same um, yellow and, like, black hair, two-tone hair, hair color. Uh, so I guess we'll find out more about him later. But uh, yeah, we meet Mash, um, Bernadette, I think is how you say it, and his uh, his adoptive father. Uh, what's his name? Regro? Regro? Is that how you say it? I don't think they ever said it like out loud. Or maybe I missed it, but yeah. Uh, Mash has no magic, but he, you know, he has the gains, so. <laughs> it, <laughs> and this Brad character, it's going to be interesting to see him as well, like how he... Are we going to see a lot of him, or he's just going to be in the background? Because he said he's going to like support... Uh, Mash, so uh, I guess he's gonna have another dad <laughs> or a big brother, and it's just gonna be him. Uh, so yeah, this looks good. I'm I'm definitely gonna continue watching it and um, see see what more they have to offer and more hijinks with Mash. So I'm ready. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I did, and I'm ready for episode two. So until then.